Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I want to show how to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, Vectors from FreePit.com and after finish video, I will share project files for download. So, first one, let's select these layers. This is all trees. And let's link to area right. Let's select this area right and let's see. Okay. And select this rod. Let's link to area right. Select this lighting. Let's click toggle switch mode. And go to normal change screen. Okay. So in this time, let's create new null object for fake camera animation. Go to layer, new and null object. And for move to anchor point center, hold control, double click, palm behind icon. And click tool and change name camera. Okay, and in this time, select this lighting. Let's link to camera. And select this background. And also arrow left and arrow right. Let's link to null object camera. And in this time, let's select this camera. Let's press S make sketch keyframe and go to 7 second press n for select work area and right mouse let's click trip come to work area and go to last second change scale 115 let's see okay and in this time select this arrow right let's see okay and let's press p make new person keyframe and go to last second and move it down like this let's see okay and select this arrow left let's see okay and press p make new passing keyframe. frame and let's move to right go to last second move to left and move it down let's see okay this is fake parallax and in this time Select this background layer, press P, make new passing keyframe, and go to last keyframe, and move it up like this. Let's see. Okay, that's good. So, in this time, let's close keyframe settings, and let's make wiggle random animation for this trace. Select this T1, and let's delete T1, I can see here. And T2, okay, and T3, go to solo. Let's select this palm behind, move the anchor point down. Let's click this again for black background. Okay, move the down anchor point, click station tool, and let's press air, hold alt, click this time icon for open rotation expression. And let's right here wiggle one. Four. For dawn expression, click this empty area. Let's see. Okay, let's unsolo. Okay, not bad. So let's edit and copy this wiggle. Select these other trees. Let's select palm behind. Move the anchor point here. Click station tool and press air hold alt click this time icon control v and click this empty area let's see okay let's select these three let's move to left okay very nice and select this layer t4 go to solo and select palm behind move the anchor point down click station tool and press air hold alt click this time icon control v and click this here let's see okay let's unsolo let's see okay nice random animation again let's select this t5 select one behind make someone move to down click station tool press air hold alt click this time icon control v and click this empty area let's see nice and select this t6 let's delete i can't see here and t7 this is static tree and select this t8 let's delete select this t9 
slip on behind, move the anchor point down, click tool, and press air, hold alt, click this time icon, control V, click this empty area. Okay, very nice. Let's select this T9, let's move to behind. Let's move right like this. Okay, that's good. So, let's create new adjustment layer. Right mouse, new and adjustment layer. Change name rain. And go to FS presses, search effect rain. And select the CC rain fill. Let's select this and use for rain adjustment layer. Okay, and let's play with these settings for better result. Let's change speed and wind. Let's see. Okay, nice. And change size. Okay, not bad. So this result is good for me. And if you want to change settings, play with here. Okay. So let's make animation for lighting. Select this lighting, go to solo. And let's go to pen tool and make masking like this. Click session tool and again select pen tool and make mask like this. Click session tool. And again, select pen tool, make like this, and again, pen tool, okay, and finally again, select pen tool, let's make this line, click session tool, okay, nice. So, go to FS presets, search FX stroke, let's select this stroke from generate folder, and let's use for this lighting layer. Go to paint style, change reveal original image, and click this icon for hide this mask pads, and change brush size like this. Okay, and let's try change end and make any shape frame. Let's press U for C shape frames. And go to here, let's change end 100. Select shape frames, make easies, let's see. Okay, select this shape frame, move to left and go to here, hold shift, press T, make opaque shape frame, go to five shape frames, change zero. And make shape frames easies, let's see. Okay, that's good. So let's use effect glow, select this glow, let's use for this lighting and change glow settings. Okay, not bad. So in this time, let's go to here and go to last shape frame, go to edit, split layer or control shift D and delete. Let's unsolo, go to first second and select this rain. Don't forget link to camera. Nice. Okay, so let's select this lighting and control D, move to right. Again, control D for duplicates. And select this lighting. Let's press R for chain rotation. Let's move to here. And Select this, press S, change scale, and move to here, and select this layer, change scale, press R, chain rotation, and this layer, okay, this is okay, and this layer, change again here, and this layer, let's change scale, move to left, and this layer again change chain rotation move to here okay let's delete this layer and select this let's 
Okay, nice. So in this time, let's select all these lighting layers and right mouse, precoms, add name lighting, click OK. And back to rain. Let's change again this screen. Nice. And let's link to camera and move to behind here. Nice. So thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.